here we've written um, 24 and 30 as a product of their prime factors and we used a factor tree to try and get the um, get this result. So what we're going to do now is to find the highest common factor and lowest common multiple of these two numbers. We'll use this information and put it into a Venn diagram. So what we'll do is we'll draw a circle here. This is for the number 24 and this circle is for 30. It's best to use this form of the breakdown rather than the index form. So let's have a look at this and compare it to this. Now in the centre are where we put numbers that are common to both, prime factors that are common to both. So we've got a 2 here and we've got a 2 here. That 2 we'll put into the centre. So we know it's in the circle for 24 and it's also in the circle for 30. Another number that's common to both is 3. So cross those out. The 3 is going to go here. So it's in the circle for 24, it's in the circle for 30. The other numbers, we haven't got any more numbers that are in common, so we place them. These two numbers are both the other numbers for 24. And in the circle for 30, we also need a 5. Now what we're going to do, we need to find the highest common factor of these numbers. Now the highest common factor is going to be in this section here. So that's the highest common factor and the lowest common multiple is going to be all of these numbers here. And what we do is multiply them together. So the highest common factor for 24 and 30 is 2 multiplied by 3 Sorry, we can't see that very well anymore. And the lowest common multiple is 2 times 2 times 2 times 3 times 5. Just to recap, the highest common factor of 24 and 30 is 2 times 3. So the highest common factor is 6. And the lowest common multiple is going to be 2 times 2 times 2 times 3 times 5, 120.